Hey everyone, today I'm going to show you how to do snow leopard print nails. You just start off with your base coat. Then using a white polish, I like this one from Wet n Wild. Apply your first coat. and then apply a second coat. Once that's dried, you're gonna go in with your dotting tool and using either a gray nail polish or a gray acrylic paint. I'm using a gray acrylic paint because I just find that they're easier to use. Put some onto a scrap piece of paper or if you have a paint palette, use your paint palette and dip your dotting tool into the gray paint. Then randomly on your nail, place different size gray dots. You don't want to place them too close together because you want to be able to paint a black border around every single gray dot. So you want to leave quite a bit of space in between all of the dots. This is how it should look when you're finished. Then take a black acrylic paint or a black nail polish if you prefer. I just prefer this acrylic paint. Put some into your paint palette or onto a scrap piece of paper. And with a small detail brush, pick up your paint. Then start painting on the black border around the gray dot. You want to do this very randomly, creating a border around every single gray dot, but you never want to actually complete the black border all the way around. You always want to have at least one little space left free. When you're painting around the circles, you want them to look like small C shapes and little dots. You also don't want them to be too smooth or perfect. You want them to kind of look lumpy and imperfect and that way it makes it look a little bit more authentic. If your lines are too smooth, then it just doesn't look very realistic. Keep painting until all of your gray dots have a black border around them. This does take quite a while, so just be patient, take your time, and remember that with practice, this will become a lot faster and a lot easier. Then once you're finished, take the black paint and fill in the white negative space with smaller black dots. You also want these to look kind of weird and imperfect, lopsided, just ra completely random little dots. Once you're finished painting on all your little black dots, go in with your favorite top coat. I prefer Sesh Beat 
I find that it smooths the nail out nicely. It doesn't smudge my design and it dries very fast. And there's the finished result. If you enjoyed this video, please rate, comment, and subscribe. Thanks for watching!